was less than a year ago, New York State Department of Health took control of Medicaid funding that was previously controlled locally. As a result, the Elmira Shemong Transit Council, Transit Council is now forced to make service changes in order to keep a transit system in Shemong County. WNY Samantha Potter attended the council meeting this afternoon and has more Samantha. John and Jennifer, the Elmira Shemong Transit Council looked at where transportation could be in 20 years and discussed where some changes need to be made. After a million dollar cut in Medicaid funding in Shimung County, the Transit Council needed to come up with a different plan for the funding they currently have. Proposed changes include cutting and decreasing routes and increasing bus fare. The Transit Council says it's currently trying to work with the New York State Department of Transportation to get an increase in state operating funds. The Shimung County Transit Specialist Tina Hager says if no changes are made, it would be less than five years before the county would no longer be able to fund the transit system. We understand that that kind of change is difficult for riders. However, when we look at the big picture or look at the future, if we want to continue to have a transit system, then we need to downsize because we had a significant decrease in funding. It's about 20% of our overall revenue, about a million dollars. Hager says by making these small changes now, the county won't be in such a bad situation in the future. The Shimon County legislators expected to vote on the proposed changes on October 14th. Reporting live in the studio, Samantha Potter, WENY News.